everyone welcome back to our channel Ecom family my name is Miriam and this is my husband behind Hello. <laughs> uh, it is a beautiful afternoon here it is fall right daddy yeah. it's fall uh, sunny and 60 degrees according what is 60 degrees in Celsius 15 maybe I'm not sure Okay, I'm not sure either. So 60 degrees here and this afternoon I'm going to clean this last batch of a last harvest of winter squash winter squash behind me. So get ready to store that for winter and hopefully spring food. <laughs> All right, everyone, if you are not yet a subscriber, please subscribe. Thank you. And if you are already a subscriber, thank you for watching our video. And please uh, don't forget to hit that bell so that you will be notified every time we have a new video. Thank you. Let's start. All right, everyone, I'm going to wipe this squash behind me with dry paper towel to get rid of the dirt so that I can store this squash in the cellar for winter use and hopefully for spring season food for us. So let's start. These squash are big. This is the last harvest that we did from the side of our house garden. These are big. Look. And this is the largest uh, butternut squash that we harvest so far. I mean, for this year. We did able to harvest 268 squash and this is the biggest squash. So, I think I'm going to, I'm not sure maybe I'm going to weigh this, but this is the biggest squash we have this year. Very big squash. I'm not sure how many pounds is this. So let's wipe this because it has dirt. You see that? It has dirt in there. So let's get rid of the dirt. I also have a few here where uh, the squash were not able to mature on the vine because I needed to harvest all the squash because the deer was already starting to nibble some of the squash. So, like this one, still greenish. So, I'm going to separate this because I'm afraid this will get to rot. Or maybe I have to cook this first. So separate this and these Mommy, are the deer right up there. oh can you chase please chase the deer and this is another winter squash this is big
Hi, chickens. We let our uh, chickens free range today. So, so they are so happy. For a long time, we were not able to free range them because of the fox. Fox eat chickens. So today, they are free range. You know, they are all over in our backyard eating bugs and grass. It's already clean enough butternut squash. I noticed this last batch, they're big. And these are Watham butternut. And I did plant some other variety of butternut squash like pilgrim and honey baby butternut squash and I think they're hybrid. And this is the, a tiny butternut squash. So butternut squash, you can store them in the cellar for at least six months. And I know a friend of mine told me that they still have their butter, butternut squash from last year. So they're able to store it for a year. I heard of it that they said you can even store your butternut squash up to a year. So that's a good news. You can store butternut squash for a year. And this squash, you're already eating this squash, and they are delicious. And I'll be busy doing this, everybody. And see you later. I will show you. I think I have here maybe 40 squash. No, here's your boots. No, don't put in the camera. Here we go. Hi, everyone. I am already finished cleaning all the winter squash. And I have here 46 butternut squash. These are all clean and somebody just passed. I didn't say, excuse me. <laughs> That's a silly girl there. You want to see <laughs> if she is? <laughs> all right, everyone. This squash, please. This squash are ready for the seller <laughs> for hopefully a year in the cellar that we can store this squash. <laughs> I know, I don't like that. And here you go everyone. Uh, all the squash are all clean. I have 46 squash here. As I said earlier, I was distracted by the little girl here. She's not very little. She will be nine years old in a month from now. And so far, we have 268 winter squash this year. Our first time to plant winter squash. And we are so happy. And we are already eating the, the squash. And they are so yummy. So we have, please. <laughs> Aside from butternut squash, we have also acorn, delicata squash, and Thelma Sanders squash. And they are delicious. Today we had acorn. I baked it. And I brushed it with honey. Very good. I didn't put butter, just honey. And this is it, everyone. So, please like the video if you like squash. <laughs> I hope you like squash because they are delicious and I would say we have a successful uh, squash this year, our first year of planting this kind of vegetables and if you are not, if you did, if you did not 
plant squash this year. Try it next year. They're so easy to plant. And thank you everyone for watching our video. Please like the video and see you in the, in the next video. Take care everyone and God bless you all. The, I can hear people here. <laughs> All right, everyone. Bye. <laughs> Bye.